Hey guys and how's it going on? In this video we will be discussing how to downgrade WooCommerce plugin. Now if you are looking to simply use a previous version of WooCommerce this video is particularly for you and make sure to stick till the end of this video so you know exactly what to do. Alright so let's just now begin. The first thing is make sure you create your backup. Before making any changes to your store you should create a full backup of your site that way always you have a safe restore point no matter what happens or as safe as can be. The second thing is using a staging site. A staging site is identical copy of your WooCommerce store that is in a safe private sandbox. It gives you a safe place to test changes to your site without affecting the live version of your store. The third thing is check for WooCommerce database changes. One tricky thing about downgrading for uh, downgrading WooCommerce versus uh, downgrading the other WordPress plugin is that WooCommerce sometimes uh, sometimes make changes to WordPress database when updating to a new version. You have probably now seen this message after updating WooCommerce. It usually says something like WooCommerce database update required. If you're downgrading WooCommerce immediately after updating and there wasn't database upgrade or you haven't run the database upgrade yet, you shouldn't have problem. However, if you did run a database update and you're now trying to downgrade a version that uses the older database version that might cause issues, this is why the important this is why it is important to have a backup of your site and test things on a staging site before you downgrade to a live version of your store. All right. So now the four, fourth step is check for compatibility issues in WooCommerce extensions. Finally, you also uh, you will also want to consider any compatible issues in other WooCommerce plugins that you are using along with your WooCommerce theme. Now, how do we actually downgrade this? So basically, there are three particular methods. Download and install an older WooCommerce version via WordPress dashboard. Thanks to recent WordPress core update, WordPress now lets you manually reinstall any version of plugin right from WordPress dashboard. Also, for that, you simply need to head over to your uh, WooCommerce plugin a page on WordPress then click on advanced view and then then scroll previous versions under the advanced options and you can see we have these previous versions and we can select any version that we like to install and then simply install the previous version like normal installation process and the second thing is use FTP to upload older version now as another option you can also downgrade WooCommerce by connecting to your server via FTP. Before WordPress added the feature to downgrade plugins from the WordPress dashboard this was the only way to manually downgrade WooCommerce. However since that other feature doesn't it does exist now there is no need to go with the added com uh, complexity of FTP. This method can also we use uh, this method method can also cause a few minutes of downtime so you might want to enable WordPress maintenance mode so FTP is another option and now the last method will be use the WP rollback plugin so basically it is a specific plugin that is provided into the WordPress to simply roll back your um, previous versions and yeah you can use that as well so i hope you found this tutorial helpful i know the video is getting a bit longer but you got the point right if you simply uh, want to downgrade it you can simply follow these steps so make sure to subscribe to the channel like the video and share with the friends and thank you so much for watching and see you around the next couple of videos